Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 9th, okay? Now, keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this deck real quick and see what we got, okay? We got the Strength card in the Page of Cups reversed. So the Page of, Cup, page of Cups reversed may be sad news, okay? Could be unrequited love, could be tears, could be a rejection. Somebody may have their heart set on somebody that is literally unavailable. Need to find the strength and the courage and the confidence to let go. Okay, that's what strength is about. Strength is about letting go. It's about. It's also about finding your self-confidence, your self-esteem, um, acting in a graceful manner. Um, there is some sort of sad news. You're probably going to need to be strong or somebody needs to be strong. They may not be listening to their heart. They may be ignoring their heart. They need to find their inner strength to master their emotions. And this is not able to master emotions. This one is. You need to find your courage. Find your courage. Listen to your intuition. Somebody may not have been listening to their intuition. Um, there's some sort of sadness here. There's a need for courage. There's a need for... Uh, Mastering, you need to master your emotions, okay? These cards fell out. Oh, one of them is the strength card. They just fell right out. We got the fool. We got the knight of swords reversed. I believe this is the seven of pentacles and the strength card. So the fool is about doing something spontaneous, taking a risk. Um, stepping into new territory, starting over from scratch, leaving everything behind. That's the first card. This is a new beginning that is going to need you to let go of your fear. Strength is the strength to let go of fear, okay? So, and these are mirroring each other because the other two are in the middle. So we got somebody here that, I don't know, they're definitely in a place of fear, okay? Because upright is no fear. This is fear. So we do have somebody here that is in, it's like they've been too, too afraid, too afraid, too afraid. Thinking about investing. Okay, this is about investment. investment. It's about relocating. It's about putting those seeds someplace else, going someplace else. Um, is it worth it? Should I do this or should I stay here? They're short-lived success. They've reached the peak. They aren't gonna get anything else where they're at. It is time to go someplace else. But courage, courage, strength, inner strength, a need to uh, not let fear hold you back. So somebody is in a place of fear. There's an opportunity here to step into new territory. That's the first card, okay? Interesting. Nine of pentacles reverse, must take action. You must take action if you want abundance. You need to find your inner strength once again. This is a lack of inner strength. This is I'm not capable. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You have to just take a risk. You have to replace that fear with faith. It's time to take a risk. And that Knight of Swords reverse is risky. And this is risky. You need to take a risk. It's time to take a risk. This is risky. This is a risky investment, okay? But if you have faith and believe just do it. Just do it. That's the, that's the fool. Just do it. But in the Nine of Pentacles, reversed is insecure. We got somebody who are here that in the Knight of Swords is as well. We got somebody here is letting their own insecure, insecurities stop them. Ace of Pentacles reverse, so losing an opportunity. Somebody is losing a golden opportunity, and if you add that to the Nine of Pentacles, which is actually right next to it, which is reverse, that's the Ten of Pentacles reverse. That's that's a complete loss. It's financial ruin. It's a, it's the loss of an empire, right? It is a loss of stability, complete loss. There's some sort of short-lived success here, and somebody is unwilling to invest someplace else. Let me get the rest of the cards. Knight of Wands, Four of Swords, Nine of Wands reversed, avoiding challenge.
five of cups reversed on the bottom of the deck is judgment reversed okay so this is poor judgment call somebody is making a they've made a poor judgment call they may feel guilty they could even be found guilty this is guilty this is ashamed self-doubt doubtful doubtful that that they will be accepted from what I see, I see that we have somebody here that is going to be taking a risk. They are going to be stepping into unknown territory. Where they have been, there has been short-lived success. They have let fear get in the way. Right around the corner is next to that strength card is the Knight of Wands. This is somebody that is going to be taking action, probably very spontaneous. We have the Fool here as well. So somebody is going to be doing something on a whim. They may be doing something, you know, They've uh, obviously thought about it. I don't think it's as impulsive as you would think, but I think that it is sudden. I think we have somebody here that is going to be finding their courage because the strength card is upright. That's right around the corner. Somebody's about to be finding, they're going to find their strength. They're going to find their courage. They're going to master their emotions. They are going to take action. This is somebody that is fierce. They're letting go of their fear. They were in a place of fear, but they're not anymore. It's like, I don't know. It's like they're giving up. They're giving up on that. They've been holding on to something. Maybe they're trying to prove a point, but they haven't had anything stable. It, ha it hasn't been stable. It hasn't been secure. They're letting go of something that is no longer secure it didn't give them what they thought it was going to give them they were short-lived success this is the death of a situation with the four of swords death of a person or idea now going to focus on the future leaving the past behind somebody has been uh crying over the spilled milk focusing on the loss when there's another opportunity that has been being ignored nine of wands reverse we have some this person is untrust you know they don't trust it's like they don't trust other people because they have been with untrustworthy into pe people in the past people that weren't solid people that weren't real which has caused them to fear it has caused them that caused them caused them all this fear now uh there's a need for discipline we fe i feel like we have somebody here that is finding their discipline um to let down their barrier, to let down their guard. They've had some sort of barrier, some sort of guard up. And so, because they were crying, they were, they were crying over a previous, some sort of previous abuse or previous neglect or something like that. Um, anyway, the four of swords is the death of a situation. I feel like we have somebody here that has been thinking, they've been thinking about a golden opportunity that has been slipping away. It is slipping away. And, and, and the only way they're going to get that opportunity is to take action. So I think that they are, action is about to be taken with that Knight of Wands. That is act now, think later. I feel like um, whoever, whoever that they were uh, afraid to take action towards has given up. This person has given up. This person is no longer investing, which is going to be sparking this action they it feels like the thing the 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 uh it's come to a halt it's like something has come to a halt somebody has turned their back because of the other person's fear Something is going to change fast with that Knight of Wands and the, the Knight of Swords reverse. There could be a sudden revelation. A sudden newfound strength or something like that. That it's time to invest someplace else. There is a new investment here. Somebody is coming in. They are coming in really, 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 really fast. This is somebody that is strong. This is somebody that is determined that doesn't have any fear this person is it's like they they if, if they had fear they don't have it anymore okay this is somebody that is going to be taking a risk they're coming in it's, it's like they're they they three of wands they've made a definite decision there's going to be an arrival absolutely this is a definite decision is being made this person could even be at a distance there could be some travel, travel, get ready, get ready, get ready, get prepared, get your bags packed or somebody's packing their bags. They're going somewhere. They're going someplace really, really fast. There's some sort of loss here with the Ace of Pentacles right in the middle. The Ace of Pentacles is reversed. It's like a lost, loss of stability, a loss of security or a, a lost investment. Somebody didn't invest. And I see that with the Seven of Pentacles. They didn't invest, so they're losing or they've lost an opportunity. It feels like they're coming to get it. You know, they're coming to get it. 
they're looking at it. They don't want it to go. They don't want it to leave. They don't want it to leave. Ooh. Chariot. Chariot is definitely getting in the driver's seat. Could definitely be packing up and leaving, moving, going somewhere, traveling, going in a new direction, taking the lead, taking charge. Somebody is definitely taking charge. They're going to be facing opposition, looking at the Five of Cups reverse, looking at a new opportunity, moving very, very fast towards that new opportunity, leaving the past behind, definitely leaving the past behind with the Fool and the Chariot and the Five of Cups reversed. Finding the courage, the confidence, the strength, the willpower to do so. Doing something uh, courageous. This is brave. Very brave right next to the Knight of Wands. The, the strength in the Knight of Wands. Doing something brave. Being very brave. Um, making a definite decision to go someplace. So somebody is going somewhere. They could be running into somebody. With that next to that Five of Cups, it's like running right into somebody. If you've been single, you know, because the nine of wands or the nine of uh, pentacles reverse is single. So isn't the nine of wands. That's independent. They're both very independent. We have both of them here. This is like, but they're both reverse. I wonder if somebody is. Uh, stepping into new territory. Definitely sudden. This is a shock. Definitely, we could have two people that are running into each other. This could be very spontaneous. This could be like a, a run in with the. We have like the the Knight of Swords, and then we have the Queen of. No, I keep getting messed up. We have the Knight of Swords reversed, and the Knight of Pent. The Knight of Wands. The Knight of Wands. So it's like they're they're and they're going. They're headed right towards each other. So I'm wondering if two people are going to be. And then we have the Chariot. So I'm wondering if somebody is going, they're headed, two people that are headed right towards each other. Uh, sudden, very sudden because of the uh, Fool and the Knight of Wands. Very sudden and the Knight of Swords. Upright or reverse. Something is going to happen very sudden, suddenly. Passionate. Passionate arrival, passionate. Get prepared, get prepared. You're going to have to let your guard down. You're going to be shocked. This is, there's some sort of shock here. We do have an arrival or somebody that is taking charge. They're, they're taking, they're getting in the driver's seat. They could be leaving. Somebody could be leaving a situation. Letting something go, letting something go that isn't stable. You know, time's up. Season's over with that Seven of Pentacles. The season is over. There is a season that is over, okay? Fool is leaving everything behind, just leaving it behind, stepping into a new experience. Bottom of the deck, four of wands. Four of wands has something to do with commitment, has something to do with a foundation, happiness. Driving. Travel, traveling, traveling somewhere, running into something. There is a new partnership headed towards a union because of that Five of Cups reverse. Somebody is headed towards a partnership. This is the end of stagnation with the Four of Swords. There's going to be movement. It's going to be rapid. There's a rapid movement here. Get prepared. The future looks bright. Leaving the past behind is clear. We have it several times. Leaving the past behind suddenly, sudden. Sudden departure, sudden arrival. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Now that's not putting in effort, not not trying hard enough, not not even trying. Emperor. Emperor. Somebody hasn't been putting in effort. They haven't been trying hard enough. That's not working. Something isn't working out. This person isn't putting in effort, okay? There, something isn't working out. Moving very, very fast with that Knight of Wands. That, that is somebody that is, you know, I don't know. This is like could be personal freedom. 
taking charge, going somewhere, uh, finding the courage. Somebody is finding the courage. Taking charge for sure. Getting organized. Making a decision. Making a decision to go someplace. The decision is made, okay? They're letting somebody go. Somebody is letting somebody go. Or they're letting something go with that Ace of Pentacles reversed. Something is, or, or it's slipping away. A lost opportunity or a missed opportunity. Somebody has missed an opportunity or they've lost an opportunity because of, I mean, the, the Knight of Swords reversed is stupidity. Somebody is ignorant. It is. Maybe somebody let their ignorance cause them to lose a golden opportunity because of fear. Or because they don't trust or they don't have any faith or anyhow. This is a huge loss because if you add the nine pentacles reverse, the ten or to the eight pentacles reverse, it's the ten pentacles. That's a huge loss, okay? It's losing it all. It's a loss of abundance. It's huge abundance. It's like burning it. It's like throwing it away. It's like throwing an op opportunity away for abundance. You know, it's just like, pew, I don't even want it because I'm so stupid. Or fearful. Sun card reverse. My nose is itching. Means you're going to kiss a fool. Uh, mm. Sun reverse. That's no, that's no, that's no growth. Sad. Loneliness due to disillusionment. Poor logic. Poor logic. There's poor logic here. Somebody's not seeing clearly. They've been in a dark place. There's no growth. Uh, false impressions. Relationship problems. Star card. Star card of wish fulfillment. Dreams. Hopes. Somebody's been in a dark place, but they have some dreams. They have the they have hope for a better future. Right next to the four of cups or the five of cups, reverse as a future. That is hope for a better future. They've been in a dark situation. They they've been unclear. There's been a lack of clarity. They've been sad, uh, not happy at all. In a situation where there's been no growth, it hasn't been working out. There's there whatever situation that they've been in, it hasn't been working out. Action is about to be taken. The, the star card is a card of wish fulfillment. This is unexpected help arriving. This is a fairy godmother granting somebody's wish. Somebody's wish. Somebody is headed right towards wish fulfillment. It's right underneath the chariot card. This is coming out of darkness. It is. They've been in a dark, I don't know, mindset. Maybe depressed. But this is definitely stepping into new territory, leaving the past behind. This is like, the star card to me is a card of heaven. It's a card of wish fulfillment. This is headed towards, you know, what you asked for, okay? Because it's right next to the chariot. So this is, a, this is like a dream come true. This is what you wished for. This, this is even stars, like even, I mean, this is recognition. Somebody may be even being recognized or they may become a star. They may become famous. I mean, the star is a star, right? It's something beautiful. Headed towards something beautiful. Headed towards victory. Because that is when you take charge, when you get in the driver's seat and you go, you head towards, you know, your dreams. Headed towards wish fulfillment. Headed towards victory. This is what I, what I asked for. Maybe somebody didn't realize that this is what they asked for. But anyway, somebody is headed towards wish fulfillment. This is the end of grieving. Somebody has been grieving over a loss. They've been focusing on the past. They've been... Feeling empty and lost inside. There's been some sort of depression. Um, taking charge. Taking charge. Somebody is about to take charge. They're going someplace. And they're going fast. It's very sudden. It's, it is. It's sudden. It's, it's very sudden. Headed towards wish fulfillment. I mean, what more can I say? It's beautiful. Woo! Now it's upright, though. This is making the right judgment call. 
This is being held accountable. This is somebody that is ready to be judged. They are ready to be held accountable. This is the end of things. This is a life-changing decision. This is being accepted. This is, this is somebody that's gotten some sort of awakening or epiphany. You know, they're ready. They're ready. They're ready. They're ready to be judged. They're ready to be held accountable. This is a spiritual awakening. So I feel like we got somebody here that has gotten some sort of spiritual awakening or they've gotten some sort of epiphany or they're just ready. They're ready. They're ready. They're ready. They're ready to be judged. They're ready to end the old life. They're ready. They're ready. They're ready for success. That's right next to the chariot and the star card. Okay, that's wish fulfillment. This is dream come true. This is this is what you asked for. This is they're ready. They're ready to be judged. They're ready. They're ready. So this is the end of things. Judgment is the end of a trial. It's the life-changing decision. A life-changing decision is being made, and it does have movement because of that chariot card, okay? That's movement. That is moving in a new direction. That's getting in the driver's seat and going somewhere. That's like traveling to a new destination, okay? So the truth being revealed. I feel like there's some sort of truth that is coming out. The end. The end. Good luck.